maniacs, this is Saturday Night Spew, and fuck it, hey man. No, 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 it's Friday, but I think by the time this gets uploaded, it'll be Saturday, so uh. All right. Dave Lombardo, formerly of Slayer, currently of Testament, but also now currently of a project called Empire State Bastard, uh, which is a cool name because the Empire State, uh, New York, if that's what it's referring to, uh, is pretty cool. And uh, swear words are always funny. And if you want it, you could also be like, Empire State Bastard are a bunch of real bastards. <laughs> A fucking stupid joke. Uh, but anyway, all right, all right, all right. Okay, so, like, here's the thing, right? Um, when I heard about this, it was like, all right, cool. It's something new with Dave Lombardo. Uh, I think any metalhead would be interested in that. But uh, on top of that, it's with two guys from the band Biffy Slyro. And, I, you know, I read that. I was like, well, they're not a metal band. Um, so, I, but they're like, all right, right there off the bat. Like, that's, you know, pretty interesting then. What might it sound like? What would, you know, something with Dave and some, like, you know, normal dudes sound like, right? But anyway, so then I was like, wait, I'm like, they can't be the same band I'm thinking of. So I went back and I listened to them and I'm like, yeah, this is like that, like, band. They're not a metal band, Biffy Slyro. They're like, um... I don't know, normal or something like that. Like, you know, you you probably, you wouldn't like them, you know, if you're not a, um, no, if you are, you know, a real, like, a uh, metal maniac, you know, like you and I, and, um, what is that from, metal mania? Why does that remind, you know when, like, bands are touring major cities and, like, you know, before the show, they might go on, like, the radio station and give an interview or something like that, and the DJ has them record, you know, like a bumper or something like that, so it's like, you know, uh, Hey, uh, this is uh, Roger Fuck from Steel Panther or something, and you are listening to the Windy City's wildest fucking K S E X or something like that. You know what I mean? Why was I telling you? Oh yeah, okay, because um, W J U L, which is uh, UMass Lowell's college station, um, they had Bruce Dickinson do that, and it was the funniest thing because he was like, uh, "Hi, this is Bruce Dickinson from Iron Maiden, and you're listening to W." J U L Metallic Mayhem. <laughs> and like, I always thought that was fucking funny because, like, you know, they probably didn't tell him to say Metallic Mayhem. You know what I mean? Like, I think he just, they weren't like, all right, so when you're done saying W J U L, we need you to say Metallic Mayhem, okay, Bruce? You know, but like, he said it anyway and it ruled and fucking A, you know? It makes me laugh. Yeah, all right, so like, all right, let's just fucking listen to it, right? Okay, uh, this is gonna be pretty new for me, too, because, like, my only experience with the song so far was like I uh, pressed play on the visualizer I would like press play just to like confirm that it was indeed like metal something you know uh, reviewable for this channel and then I skipped once right to the middle to make sure there was no like you know soft parts and then right to the end uh, you know just fucking for the hell of it right and like my my prediction for this again with only hearing like three seconds of it right was this may be the type of music that sounds like, you know, if you like music like, um, Converge, Baroness, The Melvins, Dillinger Escape Plan or something, this could end up being something like that, you know, it kind of sounded real chaotic and stuff, but all right, fucking A, dude, uh, we're just going to listen to it right now. So this is Empire State Bastard uh, with the song Harvest, and it's going to be on Roadrunner Records, and uh, fucking A, let's get it on. All right. you know Is 
that thing going on in the background. Somebody's going, somebody's going like, woo, woo. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Sounds a little bit like kind of convergy, doesn't it? There's real like gainy vocals and stuff. All kinds of fucked up right now. Confusing. Um. All right, that sounds kind of like a signature Lombardo beat with a sort of like, you know, kind of fucking hardcore-y, metal-y hardcore-y, converge sort of hardcore-y fucking uh, melody. Well, yeah, that, there you go. Um, you know, as they say, <laughs> like of all the, uh, in this case, of all the songs in the world, uh, that was definitely one of them. Yeah, man, like, I, like I said, if you, um, I don't know if it's really my thing. I mean, it's not bad, but I, I don't tend to, you know, listen to stuff like that. But no, it's not. It's not. It's definitely. Not. I didn't think it was bad. I didn't think it was shitty. Like, of course not. But yeah, I think that if you like. That what the fuck is that sort of like subgenre called? If it's even called anything, this this the kind of stuff that sounds like Converge and like Dillinger Escape Plan and all that sort of stuff. I don't really know. I don't really fucking care. But like, it's a thing. But yeah, it's kind of like that. And and yeah, man. Like, you know where I could see like the value in a band like this for for somebody like me is in in their live performance. I bet you. Yeah, I bet you they're pretty exciting live. They, they seem like the type of band that like you know those bands that sound like that that like when they perform they just like they go fucking they wig out and they go crazy on stage and they do all this weird shit and like I'm, you know not like um, not like crazy stuff like you know like David Lee Roth or Axl Rose or something fucking jump splits in the air but like you know you look at them and, and yeah you're like what drug are they not on right now you know what I mean like some kind of weird acid or something like that but I mean that's like it'd be exciting Exciting to uh, to watch, and you know where I think would be really cool to see them into not like some shithole basement or like some kind of like VFW or small club. I think it'd be cool to see them in a big fucking like place, and and like a like an arena, you know? Because man, like the first time I ever saw like you know crazy metal bands and everything, death metal bands and all that, inside a big fucking arena was in um was in the the Michelob Ultra Light uh, inside Mandalay Bay for uh, Psycho Twenty. There is something so goddamn cool about seeing like a straight death metal band, like a grindcore band, a black metal band inside a big friggin' arena because it's like it, it's like it gives the artist a chance to really kind of like open up and deliver all that like they have and everything and like I don't know, man. Yeah, that's my thoughts. So I don't think it's bad by any stretch. But either way, man, it's you know I like Dave Lombardo, the guy. Eyes and Biffy Slyro seem pretty decent, uh, so fucking A, you know, I hope they get bigger than the Beatles and <laughs> bigger than uh, fucking Jeopardy and Wheel of Fortune or something like that, right? All right, man, well, hell, you know, if you like the song, let me know. Um, if you know any other bands that sound like that, that uh, maybe I might like, well, tell me, you know? And um, if you like the uh, video, then cool, man, maybe give a thumbs up, and if you just like hearing somebody bullshit about metal, then fucking A, hit that subscribe button. <laughs> But in the meantime, all right, uh, fucking stay metal.